Konnichiwa YouTubers, this is Red Stock straight from Point Magoo, California. Today we're going to do a video review of GoBots Puzzlers. This is part two of three. And we're just going to do the other three over here. This is Jigsaw, this is Rube, and that's Zigzag. Let's go ahead and do each one. First, starting with good old Jigsaw. And again, the bad puns made by Tonka Bandai, or actually Tonka Bandai probably called him Car Robo or something. So, in the back over here, I love the fact that they got the, what do you call that, translucent lights here. That's good detailing. Uh, this one suffers a little bit because of its weird, but uh, lights on the top, and of course it broke off. Mine's isn't complete, sorry, but hey, these are nice. Again, has a nice little wheels. Translucent lights over here. I'm really digging that. Uh, the black here, I mean, it is what it is. It's common. You can tell it's a robot from the bottom, and it has a little stamping back when they toys were made in Japan if you can believe that back in 84 this one doesn't have that nice little Bandai stamp but jigsaw not too bad rolls did I mention the rubber wheels because I'm always nostalgic big fan of that okay what else we got uh, transformation fairly easy just yeah just flip the legs down and this one has the most articulation of all, all of them move the arms up okay and yeah and because of its age you can see that the shoulder joint is loose uh, shoulders you can shrug a little bit it moves up and down it's 300 degree rotation head doesn't have that much articulation but you can see the dude i mean it looks good all right uh leg uh, it's double jointed it's weird and that's for transformation it's actually very useful for transformation very spartan but you know the details are good so let's set that to the side. Okay, next up is Rube. Rube is a Mercedes SL, 300 SL. So this one has more, I like the paint apps on here, the detailing on the side, the molding. But it's plain, it's really plain. Oh yeah, and see back in the day they didn't have too bad with the licensing issue so you can tell it's a Mercedes. I love the grill. Grill is nice, rubber tires as always. And the bottom over here, Bandai, 1984, made in Japan. So, yeah, rolls well. Yeah, it rolls well. Let's go ahead and transform them. Not much to say. Let's see the back. I guess they were painted in orange back in the day, or maybe that's just the chrome kind of like fading it. Hey, let's transform them. Really easy. Pop this out. I love that this head just pops out. It's a little, there we go. Ah, detail on the head. Arms just pop out. Twist this 180 and his big feet and that's needed for his transformation. So there you can tell. Yeah. And the brother Jigsaw is just like that. So let's set that to the side. Jigsaw. Uh, that's a Nissan or Datsun 300ZX. Depending what it was back in the day. I know back in 84 it might have still been Datsun or Nissan. We'll call it, well, it's Nissan now. So yep. Bendai 84, same thing, same transformation as Rube over there. Uh, this is good old Jigsaw. And I unfortunately broke that, so that stress mark means it got separated. Blue apps, the headlights that pop out. I really dig that. Rubber tires as always. So, I mean, this is probably the nicest one of them all. Because it hides the robot extras really well. So, there we go. Transformation, just the same, pop out. And, uh, man... Here we go. Pull out the arms. Yeah. And you can tell a good amount of die cast over here. And the head pops out. Ah. There we go. And this dude actually has some molded arms. Same thing. Rotate the waist 180. And of course, I have to be careful. Pop up the legs. There we go. Same thing with this one. But this one's easier because I already broke it. <laughs> okay, maybe it's not funny, but oh well. What can you do? So the dude's just about that. I like him a little better than Rube because he's got molded fists. His head, uh, the detail's about exactly the same, the silver and blue. Uh, waist articulation, similar. Uh, hardly anything on the legs and the big ass feet. The clown feet's good because you're going to need that for pu puzzler. So you got some kind of ankle articulation. Yeah, this one. See this dude, he don't have any fists. So that's why I like good old Jigsaw better than Rue. And last but not least, 
I forgot what this dude's name cross no crossword some uh, other dude and I'll just put him over here let's see not much on the fists but that's okay oh excuse me all right jig no that's I've been saying this wrong this is jigsaw this is zigzag and that's rube sorry okay so <laughs> you don't like to yeah the, the fact that his legs broken off they, it makes it difficult to stand there's good old G.I. Joe definitely scout class size there's good old Megatron for a nice comparison you can kind of tell if you want to see Megatron there we go uh, the dudes are what they are and <laughs> they're old but what can I say alright YouTubers that's all I got uh, let's catch part 3 and finish this off. We're going to make Puzzler next.